Okay, here I got a battle. I wasn't gonna upload it because it got kind of boring at the end, but here it is. I don't even remember what I was thinking when I picked the lead, but I decided to lead with Landris. He outled me because he led with Mammoth Swine, so I don't want to take an Ice Shard or Icicle Crash. But I'm gonna go into this um, Bronzong to resist. He goes for the Stone Edge, still does not that much, so whatever. I'm gonna go for Rocks because I'm pretty sure he's gonna switch. There's not really too much he can do to me. Maybe a superpower, but even that won't kill me at full HP, so whatever. I decided to go for the HP fire, but it's actually not HP fire, it's HP dark more than likely because I forgot to change the IVs. So yeah, now that his balloon top popped, I can just go for the earthquake, break his sub. And I'm pretty sure he's going to switch, but just in case he wants to get some damage on my guy to kill me off with the Gengar. I'm just going to go for another Earthquake, and he decides to switch to a Gastrodon. So here, uh, you know I'm not going to be able to beat that thing. He's going to eventually wear me down with the, the Scald or Scald. I still don't know how the fuck to say that. Boiling water, bitch. So I go into this Rankurusu, a.k.a. Reuniclus, and I just go for the Psychic. I knew I could set up on that guy. He's not going to be able to do too much to me if I set up Calm Minds, but... I know I'm not going to get a sweep this early because he still has Gengar and his Mammoth Swine, so that's not going to work out as of yet. So uh, I'm going to go into Bronzong. I was pretty sure he might go for like Disable, so I decided to go for Hidden Power so he could Disable that and then um, use the Gyro Ball, which would be the most more effective move. Even though Hidden Power would be super effective, it's still probably going to do less than a 150 base power stab Gyro Ball. So... Yeah, everything goes as planned. He does disable my hidden power. So uh, I go for Gyro Ball here. I probably should have seen that switch coming, but I really don't mind. He doesn't have Stealth Rock up, so I have I can switch freely. And yeah, he makes a good move here. He predicts me going into my, my Uniclus, and he goes into his Gengar. But I, I don't really mind too much. Um, since he hasn't got up Stealth Rock, um, Bronzong can take a couple hits. This Bronzong is mainly here for Latios, but uh, he can handle Gengars and other people as well. So, pretty sure I go for the Hand and Power. Yeah, I do, because it would kill him off anyway. And he does have this guy. But, um, I could stay in here, but that'll be kind of boring. He's not going to be able to do too much to me. Um, but I decided to go into Kingdra, assuming he'd go for, like, I don't know, something. I forget, but... Whatever, I go for the Dragon Dance, and I knew I could live this Earthquake, but uh, he gets a crit, so bye-bye, Kingdra. I don't really think that was going to work out too well for me, though, because he still had his Gastrodon, but uh, I don't know. Outrage is probably not going to do too much to this guy, but I I at least would have been able to do enough damage with Outrage to uh, kill this thing off with the Surprise Hidden Power Ice. Uh, I'm surprised he didn't see that coming. Most people usually protect because Hidden Power Ice ran to Rosu's pretty popular it's pretty good so I go for the ice punch he brings in that guy he doesn't take it too well so he's gonna have to switch out to um, the magnetism to resist it still does quite a bit but at this point I don't really have too much that I could take at Thunderbolt since my Landris died so I'm gonna go into my own magnetism to resist that and I know I could live the hidden power fire because I have some HP investment and I'm able to revenge kill on Revit what the fuck did I just say? I'm able to revenge kill him with my own HP fire. So he goes to this mammal swine. Um I don't know if he has a superpower at uh since my bronzong is no longer at full HP, he's at about fifty percent. Superpower would be able to kill me, so that's why I left my Magnazone in there. It wasn't really gonna do too much anyway, since most of his team outspeeds me besides this guy, but I can't really do too much to him with my Magnazone, so I let it die. Now, this is where it gets kind of boring. That thing is kind of hard to kill. So, um, yeah. Since his Mammoth Swine and his Gengar are, are, like, almost dead, I'm pretty sure I'm going to start Calm Winding up and use Psychic just in case he decides to switch. Yeah. I'll go for the Psychic just in case he switches to Gengar, predicting my Calm Mind. So, um, yeah. Earth Power, Calm Mind. Fuck, I hate this game now. No, I don't. But it, it gets kind of boring. But, um, yeah, I'm going to start going to school now. Start this week. So that means I'm going to have a shitload more time to battle. And I will regain my power. Because right now I'm super garbage. I suck so badly. It's not even funny. But, yeah, he uses this Glissor as death fodder. And I'm sitting at like plus one or two. 
Uh, Life Orb Earthquake should be able to kill me, so I'm going to go into Bronze on to dodge that. And I think I'm going to go for the Hidden Power, no, Gyro Ball. Go for Gyro Ball. doesn't matter if I would have went for Hidden Power or the Earthquake. Um, it wouldn't have killed that Gastrodon anyway. And he would have been able to recover as he does here. But since I know he's not going to go for the Boiling Water, um, I don't have to risk getting burnt. So I went to my um, Azumarill thingy here. Going for the Ice Punch on it. It's like a 2 or 3 hit KO. A 2 hit KO at the HP he was at. So uh, he sacks his Gengar, which is good because I'm getting, I'm getting rid of all those big threats. And uh, again, I predict the Earthquake. He decides to go for Stone Edge, which I don't know. I, he doesn't have the superpower after all because he would have used it by now. And uh, yeah, for you to go for the Hidden Power, I probably should have went for Gyro Ball there, but I assumed he might go to his uh, thing, his Gastrodon. But uh, now that that shit died, it's only a matter of time. He's only got Gastrodon left, and it's going to be fairly hard to kill. Um, I could just like go to him. What's it called? Azumarill and try to ice punch that bitch. But if he burns me, then it's going to be pretty hard to kill it. I'm going to have to rely on this guy. So I just decided to go out to this guy and call mine up a couple times. That right there scared the shit out of me because, uh, uh, yeah, I should have went for recover. But I didn't. Like I said, I'm garbage. So he gets a crit. That mattered because I would have lived it without the crit. But now I have no options but to go out to my zoom roll here and that's a two hit KO so good game um comment rate all that shit I'm out